the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello, Gamer Nom is back. So for today's video, I'm going to help this level one noob awaken the Phoenix Food. Just a reminder, guys, you will be seeing candies. Am I grinding here in the first seat because I prepared the video in advance for this update, okay? Okay, so let's eat this fruit now and let's start grinding. So we're gonna start with the bandits with the update. Grinding will be fast because there's a compass now that will guide you to your next grinding area and the mob that you need to defeat. Okay, so use your C skill to defeat them. You just need to finish three quests, bandit quests, to reach level 10, okay? So after that, next island, the jungle. So with the monkeys, you just need to lure this monkeys in the water. You just need to do five quests and you will reach level 21. Next up, the Gorilla King. By the way guys, I recorded this in the public server. So if someone defeated it, as long as you damage it, it's fine guys. Okay, thank you bro. The goal here is to reach level 30. We've unlocked a new skill, the Hybrid Flight. Check this out. Looks kinda bad, but don't worry, we will awaken this later. Next up, the Pirate Village. So I think if you're gonna follow the compass, this will lead you to the pirates. Grinding here is really good, but not as fast as the Gamer Nom way. Go to the Marine Fortress and defeat Petty Officers, okay? <laughs> so I suggest you just follow this. Do this until you reach level 55, and that's a lot guys. When you reach level 55, go back to the Pirate Village, start defeating Buggy or Bobby the Clown. Goal here is to reach level 75, and after that, you can now go to the desert. Target is the desert officers, you need to lure them. 1, 2, 3, 4. You need to defeat, I think, 6, right? Okay. The goal here is to reach level 90. Next island, the frozen village. You need to buy the sky jump, the enhancement, and the sword. Okay, so snow bandits, same with the desert officers, really easy. Goal here is to reach level 105. When you reach that, things will be a lot faster. The Yeti, your Z skill will push it back, which will maintain your distance. Also, your Z skill has short cooldown, so everything will be easy. Goal here is level 130, and with that new skill, the Regeneration Flames. There it goes, as you can see. Now we have damage, now we have heal. Now, you need to go back to the Marine Fortress and start defeating the Vice Admiral. Guys, we have damage, we have heal, we got the Santa Hat, but guys, but when this update comes out, Santa Hat won't be available. Okay, so at 225, stat check first. Guys, no need to stat check because again, this won't apply to you, you don't have the Santa Hat. We will just go to our next island, the Coliseum. We are gonna lure here again, the Toga Warriors. Three Z skills is enough to defeat them. Goal here is 275. Next up, the gladiators. Guys, you're gonna do the same after luring them. You're gonna hit them with the Z skill. Yes, you guys it right. You need to hit them three times to defeat them too. Okay, so goal here is reach level 330. We'll be unlocking the fast kit. This will be your fourth skill. This is single target and has a shorter cooldown than the first skill. Okay, next island, the Magma Village. Again, 330. We're gonna start defeating the Military Spice. Same guys, 3 hits is enough to defeat them. The goal here is to reach level 350. Once you reach this level, everything will be a lot faster guys. 350, the Magma Admiral, right? So again, you have Z skill, C skill, damage skills, and the heal. So everything will be fine. Goal here is 425. Next up. Underwater City. We're gonna go straight to the boss at 425, Fishman Lord. Easy to defeat as long as you dodge this skill, his trident. He will be very easy to defeat. It has two lives again, just a reminder. The goal here is to reach level 500. Okay, after that, we're going to the Skylands. Not just the Skylands, the upper yard. Here we are. And we're gonna go straight to the Whisper. Level 500, we're almost there guys. So the skill to da dodge here is this one, it's Bazooka. After every skill, just go sideways. Again, your cooldown is really fast. The goal here is to reach level 575. Next up, the Thunder God. 
Okay, so the skill to dodge here is this one. There you go. Guys, just don't get near it because this boss has another skill and you don't want to get hit by that. Always dodge to the side to easily dodge that skill. Go here is to reach level 675 and after that, final grinding island, the Fountain City. Okay, the only enemy here is Cyborg. Yes, we're gonna skip them. You're gonna defeat him until you reach level 700. By the way, final skill, full transformation. This skill will heal you. And also you can still use all your skills, both damage and support skills, the heal ones, okay? Okay, so again at 700, boom, you will receive a quest. You need to go to the prison to talk to the detective. There you go, stat check, 245, two, two, mill defense, 1610 block speeds. Okay, so you need to get the key in the prison. He will then send you to the frozen village. There you will open a door using the key and here you will defeat the ice admiral guys is still the candies we're gonna use that to open the fragments go back to the prison now we can now go to the middle town talk to the experienced captain now guys here comes the update 17 part 2 okay so what's next guys aside from your candies turning into fragments we're gonna go to hot and cold there you go the password is uh, I think it's red, blue, green, and blue. Okay, go up. Talk to the scientist. But guys, it's locked. Okay, and you need 1,100 to be able to start a raid. So guys, what do you need? You need a friend that has already awakened the phoenix fruit. Yes, there you go. Again, guys, we're in the second C. So we can just buy a chip to start raiding doing the phoenix raid okay so here you go make sure to bring your friends because again they will carry you your level is too low for this there you go so what are you gonna do you're just gonna fly around <laughs> and try to survive okay so we're just gonna fast forward this guys you can stay in the other island just to stay safe there you go okay so now session etc Okay, so we're not gonna end the video here. We're gonna showcase all the skills, but I'm gonna use a different account, okay? Okay, so let's go. So I'm gonna show you all the skills, just one by one. First off, the Awakened Z skill, the Cremation Cannon. The damage is really higher. So how the X skill, the Blue Flames. Now you can heal and damage the enemy. Heal yourself and your friends and damage the enemy, okay? Next, the Flame Exodus. C skill, boom. If the enemy is near, you can do multiple damages. Okay. Next up, the swift flight, guys. What I really love with this is the flames can damage your enemy. Check that out. Really is so cool. Next skill is the blazing plumage. So this is the transformation. Yes, guys, I'm gonna admit this. This is better than the King Legacy Phoenix now. Okay. And lastly, if there is a left click. Yes, you just need to tap. Left click, boom, and there's damage, a dash, a damage, I don't know how you call it. And that's it, guys. So, make sure to have a friend that has a Phoenix Fruit Awakened to awaken your Phoenix Fruit even though you're just level 700, okay? So I hope that this video helped you. Again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I really appreciate you all. This is GamerNom, and GamerNom out!